Hey kids, Papa here. You may remember a couple months ago I showed you a long ukulele with a straight neck. It was orange, called a kukulele. It was made in the 1960s in San Clemente, California. This was also from the same time, same company, called a traholopy. It's got three sound holes, where the notes are in the body, a curved neck instead of a straight neck. Other than that, it's pretty much the same ukulele. Here's a song that was written in 1962 that was probably even played on this particular ukulele. And if not, here it is for the first time on this ukulele. Hope you enjoy it. How many roads must a man walk down before you can call him a man? How many seas must a white dove sail before she sleeps in the sand? Times must the cannonballs fly before they're forever banned. The answer, my friend, is blowing in the wind. The answer is blowing in the wind. How many times must a man look up before he can see the sky? How many ears must one man have before he can hear people cry? How many deaths will it take that too many people have died. The answer, my friend, is blowing in the wind. The answer is blowing in the wind. How many years can a mountain exist? before it is washed to the sea. How many years can some people exist before they're allowed to be free? How many times can a man turn his head and pretend that he just doesn't see. The answer, my friend, is blowing in the wind. The answer is blowing in the wind. The answer, my friend, is blowing in the wind. The answer is blowing The chords that I used in this song were A minor, C, E minor 7, F, G, G7. The basic picking pattern for this were the strings four, three, two, one, and repeated. To change it up a little bit, I always like to, I add the second and first strings with the four string and just pinch all of those three strings.
can do it any way you want, but count one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four when you're doing it.